Hello friends, it's Christy Marcotte. I decided to finish off the year with one final 6x6 video. The paper pad I'm using is from Newton's Nook Designs. It's called Love and Woofs and it's absolutely adorable. I've already selected coordinating cardstock and if you are interested in the colors and brands, I do list them on my coordinating blog post. I will be using Love from Lizzie Peel-Offs for embellishments. I have the pinstripe and also some of the mini shapes. Since this is a love collection and it has lots of cute little dog images, I decided to make Valentine cards. These cards will be going to the residents at a nearby retirement home. I'll add a handwritten message on the inside. And I know it's still December, but it never hurts to get a head start on holiday cards. With all the adorable designs, I decided to focus on the pattern paper for my cards. I will use a variety of different shape dies and also stamps for the sentiments, but for the most part, the cards are really focused on the adorable pattern paper. I love using card sketches for inspiration. If you are interested in any of the sketches I use in this video, you can head on over to my blog, christymarcotte.com, and I also have a link in the description box. If you're new to my 6x6 videos, I basically show the entire process of separating a 6x6 paper pad and turning it into a set of cards. I don't show the die cutting, but I will show the stamping. You'll also see me change my mind multiple times. Sometimes I miscut things, I stamp things wrong. I keep it all in the video though. For most of the card mistakes we make, you are able to fix them. If you don't enjoy watching the full process, you can always head to the end to see the cards, or as I mentioned earlier, you can go and check out my coordinating blog post. I have all of the cards pictured over there. Since it takes several hours to turn a six by six paper pad into a set of cards, this video has been sped up five times. The real-time recording was just under five hours, and that doesn't include my planning, prep, or die-cutting time. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Now please sit back and relax and enjoy my video.
are all the leftover pattern paper scraps, just five small pieces. In addition to the paper pad, I also use seven sheets of eight and a half by 11 and 10 sheets of 12 by 12 solid colored cardstock. And that does not include the cardstock for the card bases. I made 27 cards using Newton's Nook Designs Love and Woof's 6x6 paper pad. This collection is absolutely adorable. I'm hoping the cards will bring a smile to the residents at the retirement home. If you are interested in any of the products I used in this video, I do have links provided in the description box below. And if you don't see the product listed in the description box, be sure to head over to my blog. YouTube only allows so many characters in the description box, and I do tend to use quite a few items for my 6x6 videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.